welcome back to the channel virtue grace here um, if you're coming by for the first time you're welcome as well um, I've been in Cameroon Yaoundé precisely so today um, on my way now you can see um, en route to Douala which is the um, economic capital of Cameroon and one of the largest cities like Yaoundé and Douala like are the two largest cities here so I'm heading over there as well. Um, we just took off a few minutes ago. Now our bus is pulling into a fuel station to top up and then we go. Um, before pulling in here, we actually parked by the road by some security agent and kind of demanded for national IDs and all. Some people have actually alighted probably to stretch their legs and all, but yeah. We are all set, all good. I'm looking forward to it. So stay watching. If you've not subscribed, remember to subscribe, okay? And go through the channel. You see some of the previous videos I've uploaded from here. And you catch up, okay? I'm excited. I look forward to this. So stay watching with me. Let's go on this road trip to Douala. <laughs> so you see vendors are selling some plantain chips and some Cameroonian food that's cassava so that thing the lady is holding is cassava what we call fufu in Nigeria yeah. And one goes for like 150 francs. Guys, so we are making progress, but to be honest, I slept along the way, like almost half way through the journey. I slept late last night, I was editing, so, and I woke up early this morning to park and then I set out on this journey, so I was tired along the way, I was definitely sleepy. But I feel like now I'm okay, so let's go. Um, the position I was sitting earlier, I couldn't really feel well because there were some obstacles blocking, like I can see the footage, but I hope you guys uh, will endure with me and just stay watching, okay? I've exchanged seats with the um, man that sat beside me. Uh, Papa, he accepted to exchange his seat, so where I'm sitting now is quite better to film. So let's go. Remember to subscribe, okay? Thank you. 
to the next restaurant. See, they are selling afang. This is afang. Afang. <laughs> so, people are buying. No, I'm not buying. I only came to visit. Salut, mama. See, just typical of every business place, every transit rest point. See, soft drinks. This one is selling fruits, meat. It's a mini market. We want snap and a snap, and we now want to test meat. Yeah, your country is fine. <laughs> and then because of can, pull a can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so this is my. You want to say hi? <laughs> Guys, so yeah, I'm talking to one of the vendors here. I asked her if she would say hi, but she said no. So that's our bus, and you see it's our market here. Everybody is selling. And we are going to continue our journey that way. Yeah, guys, so that's it. So far, so good. I'm enjoying the trip. Like I told you guys, I slept along the way, but now I'm fully up again and active. So stay watching. For me, these are some of the highlights of my trips across Africa. When I get to do road trips and get to these like small villages, see how locals conduct their businesses, go about their daily lives. It's just very much alike. Like It reminds me again how much similar we are as Africans. And I love it so much. It's this connection that helps me to really appreciate um, who we are as Africans and all. So yeah, that's pretty much it, you see. What's the name of this place? Bienvenue au marché de Vivre de Dope. <laughs> that's what I'm, I'm trying to read that sign post for you guys. Yeah, so <laughs> that's our car there. I'm just stretching my legs. Maybe I should walk a little bit and show you guys around. So let's see. <laughs> travel in Africa you see the the car with loads of banana or plantain bunch on on it we travel like this in Africa the bus is packed full so they have to construct another cart on top of the bus as a carrier for luggage <laughs> See flags of different countries because of the Afcon tournament going on in Cameroon. You see lots of flags, not only in the city, which is Yaoundé, but also I've seen quite a few along the countryside. And you can see some here. Drop a comment if you see your country's flag. Now we are stationed the passage. See flags waving, like we're approaching a town. That's, I think that's Senegal. I can't see Nigerian flag, oh. Eh? Why? Why? Uh, let me see where we're approaching. Okay. But it seems like we're getting closer to Douala. Yeah, I've been told that the name of this town is Edea and it's about 16 kilometers 
from here to Douala, so we'll soon be in Douala. <laughs> if you are from this town watching this video, drop a comment. Is this your town? Cameroon, your town looks cool. But I'm not happy with this town. I've not spotted Nigerian flag. I'm seeing flags of other countries. What happened now? <laughs> Let's hope you redeem yourself as we progress and I will see the giant flag in front. Else, can you see it? Voila, creepy. See? This is a day out. By the way, guys, today is a Sunday, so. another rest point. As usual, see, people are coming to sell. I can see more flags there. I can now spot Nigerian flags. There is a lot for the bois and several other flags. So like I said, after this town now, we'll get to Duana. Remember to subscribe, okay? If you've not subscribed... But not as big as the one in the Olympic Stadium in Douala, in Yaoundé rather. Thank you. 
Welcome to Douala, guys. Um, one thing I can notice, obviously, is there are lots of motorbikes here compared to Yaoundé, the capital. And just so you know, Douala is to Cameroon what Lagos is to Nigeria. It's the economic hub, economic capital, if you like, of Cameroon. We actually um, now I'm still at the bus station. We got in around 4:30 something there about here. Yeah. The trip was fun. It was cool. It was okay. I enjoyed it. And um, hope you guys enjoyed watching the vlog as well. If you have, drop a comment. Okay, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and do all those good things. And stay tuned because I will bring you more videos from Duala.